Hello everybody, I'm Claudia and welcome to my daily sketch series. This is day 11 and if you made it to this day, congratulations. And if you didn't follow the sketches, then just do it because sketching every day will really, really, really improve your art skills. So today this is going to be a winter landscape with a lake in the foreground. You can see I already laid out the waterline and now I'm sketching some indications of evergreens. They are growing on a hill to the left and to the right and I'm just doing this very very easy with a with an ink pen doing some stuff in the foreground and a big one on the right this is a stone lying there I'm now changing to my black ink and I'm doing this with the sponge with a really light illusion. I'm just tapping and giving these trees some structure. Structure. And this is really a really easy technique. I'm going in with the brush now. And this is not completely black ink. This is a dilution with water. This is a dark gray. And I'm just coloring in the tree line, some trees, some tree shapes, and going in the water line. See that I, I did not do the line, I did it in, a, in an ir irregular way. Doing the evergreens to the right. And this is really easy. I'm sketching from a reference photo. I have a, a Pexels account. This is Pexels is a site where you can uh, find um, stock photos to use private or in a commercial way. And um, I have an account there where I have a collection. Everybody can go to that collection and you can sketch with me every day. And I would love to see your sketches. So please you can tag me on Instagram or you can write me an email. You can go to my website and um, comment there or comment here on YouTube. I'm now doing the reflections on the water. And remember when you're doing reflections, they are like a mirror but not exactly as the original because the water itself has a texture on the surface. It's not very common that the surface is completely flat because you always have some ripples there. I'm now going in with a sponge and a very very light illusion and just tapping in the mountains that are in the background. These are mountains with snow on it, but they are not completely filled with snow. So you have all these textures. If I would do this with a brush, um, this would be a very, very long <laughs> sketching video. So I'm doing this with a sponge and now adding some ink to the right because the light is coming from the left. And you can see that I'm just um, doing the shapes and now you can see I, I realized that I did a mistake on the stone in the foreground. I, so I'm adding shadow from the right. I'm right handed so normally light is coming from the right side. In this case it is not so. So we are at the end. Thank you for watching. Yeah.